let me just give you a little bit of a update. Now, last time, um, our leader, Julius, gave, you know, um, Mr. King a, you know, what the fuck am I trying to say? Oh, let me try it all over again. Last video, Julius gave Mr. King an option. He could either be killed or he could surrender his gang. He chose to surrender his gang after he kills Tanya. That skank. As you can see, we almost got everything purple. Saints have taken over almost everything except for one last little block. This is the last mission, people. The last mission for Saints Row 1. Let's get into it. I've been chatting with King, and it looks like Tanya's takeover didn't sit well with everybody. The Vice Kings are fighting amongst themselves. Now's the time to take them out for good. King said he was going to come along. I hope he hasn't gone soft. And don't ever worry about me, baby boy, because I'm going to handle mine. All I'm saying is that since you got here, you've been nothing but talk. I've smoked dozens of fools before. I ain't adding to the count unless I have to. Oh, that's just fucking great. I said don't worry about it. I don't want you bitching out when you see your crew. Ain't my crew, son. That's why I'm here, remember? So how about you put your dick away, pick up your gun, and try to keep your knee away from the bullets? Uh. Oh, you heard the cocky son of a bitch. Let's roll. <laughs> Well, I can see the power struggle going on here. Is everybody in the car? Good. Last thing we need is to lose. Because fucking someone gets left behind. If we want to get to Tanya, we got to get the code to the elevator. She How tells are we gonna everything get that? to her fashion consultant. He shouldn't be too hard to break. Who is this guy? Some Euro trash motherfucker named Stefan. I hate him already. <laughs> Stefan actually is in a commercial. Unfortunately, I couldn't put any commercials on here, but he is someone from one of this the commercials. This was a Saint great Tom. idea, Ben. It's kind of stupid to give your fucking fashion consultant your codes. It's kind of dumb. Like, who the fuck are they? What, do they come to your house? every day and pick out your clothes? That's kind of weird to me. Mm, I'm not rich, so I don't know if that's a normal thing. Oh, shut the fuck up. I'm doing the best I can. He is trying to start trouble with me. You see this, right? He is trying to fucking start trouble. I'm not trying to start trouble. I'm trying to make trouble in the game another way. Ooh. Ooh, awesome hair. Oh, awful hair. Ah. Uh, I can't look common. I'm ready. Dude, oh my goodness, I'm so sorry. Dude, this is getting ridiculous. This war is in the way. See, that's what happens when you keep following a king. Uh, when you keep pestering a king. And I'm not talking about him either, I'm talking about me. Takanawa is like the king of fucking Chinatown now. <sighs> mean gag, man. Two Asians taking over. Well, really? That's how we fucking drive, bitch. Bitches, fucking cops. 
the hell is going on here? Because of Stefan's fucking stupid ass? Alright. Can we just go? I must take King's car. King's car is destroyed! Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me! Like, we were doing so good. And then the cops kept fucking with us, man. We weren't doing shit. I mean, yeah, we were hanging some freaking European idiot out of the freaking window, but that's not a big deal, right? He's a nobody. Just some rich fashion person. Guess it makes him somebody. I really was thinking about trying to play San Andreas, but everybody keeps saying, oh, it's too far back. So I might not do it, but I might do it later. I might just do it later, like, fuck it. I never played it before. And everybody says, like, that's just the best GTA game that's ever been made or whatnot. Like, I've heard some people say that that's, like, the best one with the best story. So I might have to just play it. Let's get this Stefan guy. Now you're gonna tell me what I wanna hear. You understand? I don't understand why the cops care about Stefan. That car just disappeared. It's creepy. So you better start talking. I don't know it. What are you doing? I don't like this. This makes me vibrate. God damn it. Dude, that that would have killed him. Like seriously. Tanya tells me nothing. My arms get a little tired. I just love her shoes. Uh. Your bitch ass better stop acting in third person. Your friend with the awful hair will release them on at once. Oh my God. This is hard, man. I can't look common. I can't look common. What an asshole. Tell me how to get to Tanya. Just oh, tell me why the do you hate the beautiful you. Stefan has done nothing to you. Why do you hate the beautiful people? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. The code is three one, three one. Please don't hurt Stefan. Thanks for your help. Who speaks in third person like that? Oh my, we pretty much killed him. I should have let Gat All right. You sure you ready? King, the only person in this <sighs> I'm like getting annoyed, increasingly annoyed at the amount of bullshit I gotta go through. You know what we're about to do? Seriously? This is what we're gonna Oh my god, it's locked. We have to go to forgive and forget. We gotta do it. We gotta do it. We gotta go there. He is very encouraging. I like that. We gotta get this repaired. It's so far away, though, dude. Oh, if I could just do this, I will be so happy. Just go to forgive and forget and fucking do this. Like, seriously, if I have to start from the beginning, I'm gonna slip my wrist. It's gonna happen. Because it's fucking long. That's the one, number one downfall. first thing you gotta do is clear a path to the elevator. What then? Hang on. Kind of plan. I probably didn't even need to go to Forget and Forget because it's farther away. As you can clearly see, but I want to make sure this car is straight. I mean, you know, when you block my path, that doesn't help. That doesn't fucking help at all. Yes. Now. I just want to make sure this is, like, completely right. Oh my god. Like, the closest... Ah, uh, ah! Uh, I'm gonna go all the way over there. Is there one closer? Gotta go get a rim job. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so let me go get some rim jobs real quick because we don't have a time limit. So I just gotta be super careful. Cause if this car blows up, that's gonna be some ass. I don't feel like doing this over again. The problem with this game, like I was saying before, which I don't think I got a chance to finish, is that. The saves for the main story are really far away. Like, if you don't 
win it, you gotta start all the way from the beginning of that mission. Which is really a pain in the dick. Like, seriously. It's not a horror game, so it, it has no excuse and I have more saves in the middle. When you reach a checkpoint, you should be able to save. Or it should save automatically and then take you back to that checkpoint. It shouldn't be so hard. And I know it's an older game, so that's the reason why it's like that, but it's still frustrating. 1000 dollars I had to pay to get this shit repaired. What the fuck kind of car is he driving? That's some bullshit. That's what that is. Alright, well the car's repaired, so we should be fine now. Get out of the way. Alright, we're there. Let's do this. Do we go in? Why couldn't we do that before? Fucking bullshit, that's what that is. Look at it, they're like all circled around a ring. You guys shooting or you guys looking around? Jacking off. That was kind of rude to say. I mean, I don't want to be rude, but seriously, they weren't doing anything. I like super killed him, jeez. Cause Gat already shot him in like the gonads. Alright. We got this sewn up to a T. It's just all in there, huh? What's this it? We're now to pick up that money. Penthouse. <laughs> I'm gonna skull fuck that bitch. Uh. Hope you don't mind hepatitis. What? Ugh. <laughs> yeah, I have, like I like randomly talk. It's weird. This big. Bitch with the big tits. No wonder everybody got a problem with it. She's got like all girl crew going on here. Girl power. Get all chicks. All chicks with guns. Oh no, no, they're not. Never mind, I take it back. It was just like one receptionist chick with a gun. Ooh, is this it? This next area, we just we did we just come from here. We just we just just come from here. So we're going back into an elevator, dude. I don't know why I just randomly say words in English. I don't understand. Even Gat was like, "What?" <laughs> do we still got that on the floor? Yeah, we get that. Dude, there's like random hot chicks with like different kind of clothes on. See them? Oh, these might be prostitutes. I'm thinking that. This is going swimmingly. All right, we got this. We got this. Let's go take that bitch out. Some guys just never get enough of me. I've had more than my fill, bitch. It's over, girl. You're not gonna be able to fuck your way out of this one. That's cute, sweetie. That's just precious. Jeez, I need to give her a chance. How is she still alive? Please. She just got shot to shit. Please don't! Oh, Tanya, uh. do yourself a favor and die with some dignity. Oh, she had the ugliest face. Damn, right in the car. That sucks for your car. We better get out of here. The cops will be here soon. <laughs> you coming, King? That sucks for your car. All right, let's go. That had to be heartbreaking, though. Hey, I know what you told Julius and all, but why don't you stick around and roll with us? I'm sure he wouldn't mind having you around. Don't bet on that. 
Think you can find a way back to the row on your own? Aisha, you know. The pussy calls. Oh. You did good in this, son. Here. I don't think I'll be needing these anymore. Yeah, I definitely gotta change his face in the next game. He looks horrible. Oh, we got the crib! And Johnny's car. And all the Vice King cars. Third Street owns this town. Now that's not to say shit didn't cost. And I ain't talking about what happened to Johnny's leg or losing limbs. Those two were soldiers. They knew the risk. Hell, Johnny gets off on it. We crushed a lot of families, player. And some of them gonna holler at us. But believe me when I tell you, we did the right thing. With the rollers wiped out, Benjamin gone, and the Colombians in our pocket, there ain't gonna be a need for a gang war ever again. And in the end, that's gonna save a lot more lives than we took. So relax, man. You earned yourself a break. You've impressed the hell out of me, son. And I told the crew, you're gonna be my right hand. Hold up. Some Barry just turned on his flash. Yeah, player. I think I'm gonna have to call you back. This may take a while. Just say the word. family talk but I didn't talk there that was it oh come on there's more thank you okay so we reached a 20 minute mark so I'm actually oh let's look at the let's look at this real quick oh yeah empty I actually really want to show you guys my crib so I'm gonna do that real quick I don't care if we go over where is it Oh my god, it's raining cats and dogs and chickens and goats out here. There's not a car in sight. That's great. I need to get across town. I have no way of getting there. Oh, here we go. Excuse me! I need this ride. Get your ass out of there. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this crib. Because I've been showing you guys all the cribs that I... uh obtained through uh, legal you know means I totally I, I go to a realtor um, they show me around I uh, talk to uh, my crew they all help chip in we pay for it right that's how we get all these cro uh, places these cribs that's how we're getting them yeah that's how we're doing it we're totally not killing everybody and just taking it for ourselves that would be just barbaric right and illegal and illegal we're not doing that at all no we earn this dude I can't see a sh fucking thing oh there we go dude that girl got super killed it kind of sucks though like we didn't even get a chance to kill her with dignity oh okay here we go So, here we are. Over here is my entertainment area. Mm, yes, this is where I entertain guests. By the way, I washed everything thoroughly with bleach and like super hot water, okay? This is my uh, memorial of the row. You know, I sit here and look at the picture of the row. Uh, that's, that's a little bit of Chinatown right there where I came from. Soup kitchen's there too. It's that blue little speck area of my head right there. That's where the soup kitchen was that my mama ran. Put it over there so I could look at it and cry. Oh yeah, this is the way down. No, it's not. That's the weapon area. So that's where I keep all of my guns. I keep my books here. Nice and tidy. I keep my my plaques here. I got all Aisha's golden records going on here. Okay. This is my bedroom. Once again, bleached and washed everything needed to. 
gotta save him though, you guys you know do not want to do that over again anyway yeah um some more records gold records this is my uh entertainment system right here this is where i sit to watch my entertainment system right there yeah my clothes i don't have any clothes uh this is my kitchen okay it's my bar that's not even a kitchen like seriously look at that there's alcohol here and a tv is that supposed to be a refrigerator okay so i guess this is my bar area this is my cash area <clears throat> i just had to take that real quick this is my um skylight sitting area where i can look out at uh the window up there yeah down here down all these steps uh, this is my ballroom um aisha came over here and did a song uh she was standing about here on a stage and we all danced the night away uh gat was so proud uh this is my apartment for some reason i have a photo of it in my apartment weird this is my office area uh, i'm still looking to hire more people if you would like to apply for uh takanawa's you know uh workforce area just go to 1-800 uh taka now and then uh, um this is my seating area where i take clients for business purposes and this is where uh you know i'm still looking for some employment here i'm still looking for someone to help me but uh yeah okay and this is an elevator that leads to a place in this place so yeah you pretty much saw everything i think let me just make sure let me just make sure yeah that's my office area once again just in case you forgot here's my other office area this is the one that the nice employees go to this is the one that uh the upper class employees go to the ones that i think are doing a great job this is the one i put them in right here right here a lot more space, a lot more room, more copy machines, nicer. Yeah. The other area is for uh, first comers. So, yeah, you gotta work your way to the other side. So, now you saw my home. My, what, fourth home? Yeah. All legally obtained, once again. I am really out of shape, people. Let me just go to my bedroom right here. Yes. Um, thank you for coming. Thank you for see in my crib thank you for joining in on uh cribs i guess i uh, i'll see you in the next video where we will be seeing the very last bit of uh saints row one see ya and have a good one